There are two ways to win. You either get all three cats. <laughs> I mean, they're doing the standard cat thing of showing their butt. Hey guys, you have McGann and Shin. We are the Game Flames, and we are here to do a tutorial demo of Boop by Scott Brady. This is brought to us by Smirk and Laughter Games. Okay, so this is the interior of the box. I love this game board. It is like a little quilted bedspread and our little squares are our moving pieces for the game board. And we are going to listen very carefully to the people at the demo table who said, take the box. This is a bed skirt to help you understand that the box goes upside down and the bedspread goes on top. So the game tokens are very cute little wooden pieces. We have kittens, which you can easily distinguish because their tails are always up. And then we have cats, which are chonkier boys and their tails are painted on the back. And I love that they all have different expressions. They're, they're so cute. Like the gray ones are so happy and the orange ones just look like what? Mischievous. <laughs> they're just like what? Now normally you would set your pieces on the board in an upright position, but so you can see it better on camera, we are going to do them uh, tails down. So the base basic rules for the game are that you want to get three kittens in a row, you remove those, you will turn them into three chonky boy cats, but they are not on the board, they are going to go over into your to use pile. Whenever you put a piece down, for instance right here, that boops any cats that are around you, and yes you can even get booped off the bed. But there is a special rule here that a cat will boop a kitten. But if we set a kitten down, the kitten will not boop the cat. The man at the smirk and laughter booth told us that I am not afraid of my kids, but I am afraid of my wife. So an adult cat will boop another adult cat and the kittens as well. There is friendly fire. So if a kitten jumps up onto the bed in between not just yours, but your opponent's pieces, it does boop all of them. So if I placed my kitten here, it would not boop the cat, it would boop the kitten in their respective cardinal direction. Yes, and it will boop anyone within one space of you. And there is also another unusual little uh, piece here where let's say we have two kittens here and then you put the cat down. The cat will not boop these kittens because they stabilize each other from falling off the side. Right, so if the cat were to jump here, the kitten gets booped but collides here and so stays where they are. So they give each other a hug instead of falling over. It is important to note that kittens in a row, kittens graduate to cats and go to essentially your your little cat stash. Okay, I highly recommend that you have some kind of container, you can use the top of the box for boop whatever, to put your big boy cats in because when your kittens turn into cats, you're going to trade the kittens out and take one cat for every kitten. So you don't want to get those mixed up. There are two ways to win. You either get three cats in any kind of row or you get all eight cats on the board. It's your move. You pet a cat last. Okay. Uh, so the center of the board is definitely the most powerful area, so we're going to go with that. I agree. Boop. 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 No. You booped me off the bed. Mm-hmm. I, too, shall boop you off the bed. Mm, you're getting much better at this. I've had practice. Boop. Boop. Okay, so when I place my kitten here, the boop would normally go there, but that stopped by this kitten, and now these three... I like to imagine that they have a hug, and so that's why they don't fall. Aww. And when you upgrade to cats, they do not go on the board, though. No, they, they go they into your go pile. Into my stash. Your catio. The catio. Now, this is a good thing to clarify. When I put this piece here, this cat's going to boop off, but these two aren't. But if for any reason you have four kittens in a row, you can only pick three of them in a row to become cats. So I could pick these three or these three, but not all four. So. In this occasion, this kitten's getting booped off. But I thought that that was a good thing to clarify. I'm going to put these three here. Take out three chunky boys. And I need a chunky boy to make sure that this one gets booped too, otherwise kittens cannot boop big boy cats. Yeah, 
No, you my, right off the bed. My kitten. Okay, so I can see what she's doing here. She can now take one of her kittens, put it there. The kitten can't boop the big cats. But the kitten can turn into a big cat. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to try and disrupt that by placing my last big boy right there and booping these two around. Hmm. Well, the strategy I just accused you of doing, I'm going to do. Good. I'm glad you did that. You know why? Because now I have room to do the same thing. And just the kittens leave the board, not the cat. They upgrade to Chunky Boys and go into my catio. Well, interestingly enough, I can theoretically keep replicating this procedure until you stop me. Well, it's going to be like that. Okay. All right. Fine. Get thee away from each other. Mm. Boop. 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 Oop. Ah, no, you boop over there. You boop over here. That boops. These two give each other a little hug and cannot move. Oh, when I'm out of my big cats. No! Got too many chunky boys up there. Oh, wow. Wow. I can't. And you fall off, but I got my three, three chunkies in a row, so my chunky big boy cats have won the game. Oh no, outwitted by my hubris, I was so concentrating on getting more cats that I didn't notice your three in a row. And look how pleased they are with themselves that they're victorious. How nefarious. <laughs> You and your self-interested cats. Good game, dear. But this has been Boop by Smirk and Laughter Games. Thank you, Scott Brady, for making this. It is cute and adorable. Anyways, guys, you've been listening to McGann and Shin play Boop. We are the Game Flames here on the Family channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comment, whatever you want to do. It is always appreciated. And other than that, I think we'll see you in the next game, guys. If you had fun watching today's video, don't forget to subscribe so that you can see more and let us know in the comments what other videos you might want to see in the future. Also, don't forget to check out our other channel, The Fangirl, where we talk about all kinds of movies, TV shows, and even books and comics. But viewer discretion is advised. See you next time, family members!